guys, so you have seen me in this outfit three different times, and I do apologize, but I have to get my filming done in one day, and I don't feel like changing my top, because I just don't feel like it, because then my hair will not stay this way, even if it's not great, it's better than what it was trying to do earlier, so yes, I have empties for you guys today, and I just, here they are. Everything, as always, will be listed down below in the down bar, so if you are interested in something and you didn't hear the name, it's down there in order as well. So, let's get on with it. The first product I have here is a body spray from American, no, from Abercrombie & Fitch for him, and I don't know what fragrance this is. I don't know, Pearson Elite? is the fragrance and it's just one of those aerosols. Why am I trying to spray it on myself? It just smells really good. It smells like a guy and I love it and these are like, I think these were $10 at Abercrombie & Fitch but American Eagle has them for $5 and so does Hollister so my boyfriend likes these sprays better than like cologne um, because he's like it covers a larger area so he has a lot of these and I think he's actually out now so I know what to get him. Um, so yeah. Another Favo is the Dial Seasonal Collection um, hand soap. And this is in Iced Berries. And I loved this scent a lot. Like it was nice and like very like fruity and fresh. It was just really good. It's like really good. Really good girls. Let me see if I can smell this. Yeah, it just smells like berries, but it just, like, was so good. It reminded me of Sugar Plum. What is that called? Sugar Plum Fairy? The pink one around Christmas time that they don't have all the time, every year. I think it was called, like, Sugar Plum Fairy. I don't know. From Bath & Body Works, that's what it exactly smells like, and I loved it. So, had to pick it up once again. Alright, so I was sick, um couple times since this empties video so I don't know when this was from but this is the Tylenol cold and mucus severe medication this is my favorite to use it has like a cool burst kind of flavor so it basically tastes like you are drinking thick uh, mouthwash um, but it really helps your sore throat a lot um, and it helps you get over sickness quicker I have an autoimmune so it doesn't take me like two days and I'm good to go like but it, is, it um, cures it a lot faster than just taking Robitussin or something like that. So, love it. Then I also went through a bottle. Ooh, it leaked. Ugh, it's leaking on my hand. This one is leaking and it's all over my hand, but this is the Tylenol Cold and Flu Severe warming one. I don't like this one as much. It tastes like poo, like a lot of poo. It's in like honey lemon flavor. It just doesn't taste very good. It does warming, so it does soothe the throat, um, but I just don't like the flavor, so I would rather suffer than drink this. Um, that's how bad it is, because I don't normally care if it's anything like cherry, grape, like I know they're all disgusting, but I don't normally care, but this one's really bad, so I'd rather just pick a different flavor, but the warming was nice. This is just so weird that it's like leaking or something. Then my boyfriend got me my favorite scent from Victoria's Secrets, and I hadn't had it since freaking middle school, which was eight years ago. And yeah, this is the Victoria's Secret Love Spell um, fragrance, and I just got like the little, um, the tinier version because they were like 2 for 10 and I also got at that time Coconut Passion which is really good too. It smells kind of vanilla -y. Um, but yeah I love Love Spell. It's my favorite scent ever. I would, I definitely have to get like a full size of this but he bought it for me on the 29th of Feb, no, like the day after my birthday. So it was like the 12th, 13th, something like that is when I picked this up and he, I used it up on March 1st, was the last day. So this didn't even last me a month, girls. So then my boyfriend's deodorant is in here. And this is the Old Spice Fiji scent. Um, and 
and it's the like what is this called it's not the gel it's like the solid so this is his favorite scent I mentioned it several times he's still purchasing it I like to show these video I like to show these products multiple times just because I want you guys to know that we are using the products that I say that we do like because um, this is the one that he always goes to it's something Old Spice and it's always a solid Fiji is his favorite scent but yeah alright so then I used up sorry the medicine spilled on some of this stuff but I used up a packet sample of the Kat Von D Locket Featherweight Primer and Base and this was interesting I don't think that I would pick this up just because I didn't really see any difference. I don't really think that it like made my foundation last or anything. It does have glycerin in here, I feel, because it was tacky. And it does it does smell like a man, which was strange as, as well. But I kind of liked it. So it kind of made me think of the Nivea aftershaving thing is basically what she was trying to do with her primer. Um, so, yeah. Oh, gosh. All right. So then we went through a bag of chinchilla food. I don't know how long I've been accumulating these things, to be honest with you guys, but this is the KT Healthy Support Diet, Forti Diet, um, Chinchilla Food. This one is my favorite to purchase for them because it's just a lot healthier than the other ones, but they're like out of it all the time, so. Another bag of food, um, which is the KT Gourmet Variety Diet, um, by with Fiesta in it, Fiesta brand stuff in it. Um, I don't like this one because there's a bunch of treats in it um, because the variety is not good for them, like it's trying to tell you. Because um, I've done a ton of research and that's why I say that. But yeah. So then I did not go through this lipstick. This was just a horrific, this was just like a horrific incident that happened. I was like mixing all these colors together on my lip and then I wanted to like wipe off my thing, which is what I, my lipstick, which is what I always end up doing. And this one broke. So this is by Too Faced and this is in Living in Sin and it's, it's gone. It's like pointless. This is the last time. I'll be able to use it. You guys saw it. The last time I'm using this product was just there. But yeah, it just broke. And then I emptied another Garnier Moisture Rescue Refreshing Gel Cream for dry skin. That's gone. One of my favorite um, moisturizers. I have um, the backup already or the refill or whatever. Um, already on there. I've been using it halfway through it. It's $6. It lasts me about a couple months and it's great. Alright, so this is the Marvelous Moxie Lip Gloss in Scene Stealer. And this is just like one of the smaller versions, not like a full size. But I did go through this pretty quickly. Within a couple of weeks, it was gone. And this was like my favorite lip gloss there for a while because I took it to work. It was very hydrating. It looked super cute. And it made your lips just look beautiful. So, yeah. That was a fave. Ugh, just everything is dripping with this gunk. Alright, so then I have this in here to remind me to tell you guys that I did use... Um, both of these bath bombs that I had gotten from Christmas. I got the Butter Bear bath bomb, which was very nice for the skin, very nice and like soothing. My skin felt so moisturized afterwards. It was amazing. Um, but you can only get it around Christmas time and it only came in sets apparently. And then I also got the Shoot for the Stars bath bomb, which was really fun and um, it smelled so good and I loved the colors and again it was nice and hydrating for the skin not as hydrating as the Butter Bear but it just felt nice it was super fun to just sit in the bath with a bunch of fun colors and I really liked that one and the scent was very nice and soothing for nighttime and lastly I went through a Paradise Spa Lemon Mint hand sanitizer I just picked it up at Walmart um, and this was great, worked good, scent was nice. What can you say about a hand sanitizer? It did the job. And that's it for my empties. If you guys did enjoy this video, please thumbs up the video. Subscribe to be notified when I upload on Tuesday. 
Saturday and sometime throughout the week once again for the bonus video. Um, share this with all your friends to see the products that I love to see if they love them as well. Comment down below if you use any of these products and again check the down bar for the list of all the products I talked about in order as the way I mentioned them and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!